My name is uh, Eddie Seymour. I'm the director of the Tegra business here in Europe. And I'm here at Embedded World where we are showing with our partners several Tegra-based products for the embedded market. Yep, so we were showing Tegra-based products, uh, working with our partners such as LG and Samsung and Motorola, both in smartphones and tablets. Uh, we were showing the real benefits of Tegra, running you know, applications, 3D games, uh, running on those platforms, Flash, and you know, showing the real advantages for the Cortex-A9 in, uh, in those platforms. We were the, the predominant player working with uh, Google showing Honeycomb on the tablets, um, especially, as I say, with uh, Motorola and the LG platform showing that for the first time at MWC in, in working uh, products. So, yeah, we, we premiered uh, working products from our partners uh, with Honeycomb's um, OS uh, from, uh, from Google with Android. Um, and uh, now we're really moving forward with, uh, with Tegra into our embedded partners here at Embedded World. No, this is not a new venture. We actually have been embedded for, in the embedded market for uh, you know, uh, a few years using you know, GeForce and also our Quadro platforms and we've used Ion. Um, so really Tegra makes a really good extension to uh, embedded part market and in fact when you look around the stand here you'll see they're actually showing some of our uh, original products based on Ion and then bringing in the Tegra platform that they're using their experience in the embedded market. It fits really well because you know you can see when you walk around the show there are lots of display manufacturers, very graphical representations, you know, especially in the medical world where you know they want to get quick information in a graphical format, you know, whether they be a PDA device or a tablet device walking around in a hospital, that works really, really well. Um, you know, there are other devices here such as displays for you know, airports and uh, other locations where they want to use display content in 3D that fits really well with their model. I mean, yeah, I mean, we're using low power, and if you look at our friends over there from CompuLabs, they have a very small footprint, what we would term a traditional PC. It's a small box, um, but very low power, you know, sub three watts. So, you know, this is really good from an environmental point of view, as well as, you know, you're putting it in uh, devices that, you know, are very close and confined and use that advantage for low power. Yeah, so we, uh, we have several demos. Um, let's say CompuLabs at the far end here has a very small form factor PC based on Tegra. Um, we are, you know, the embedded market also has some standards like Q7. So our partners Seco and MSE here are showing Q7 based Tegra modules for the industrial environment. And then we have Toradex at the other end here, along with Avionic Design, who are using the SODIM format type devices for time to market. So, you know, where they have customers already using products based on SODIM, they can basically populate uh, Tegra into that market very quickly. Um, I think we will touch many different verticals, and again, we're enabling our partners to touch many different verticals. You know, whether they be small or large, you know, our partners will be able to support that and drive that market and enable them with the great graphics and technology that we have.